Good morning, Bear Buddies. This is the week of May 17th through May 31st. Here's a joke for you. What did the, what did the Dalmatian say after lunch? That hit the spot. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the re Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let's check in with our special reporters to learn about this week in history and some tips for being a barrel buddy. This week in history, in major rights and major civil major civil rights victory, the U.S. Supreme Court came to the decision in Brown versus the Board of Education of Topeka, ruling that racial segregation in public ed educational schools is forbidden. The, histor the historic decision which brought an end to federal tolerance of racial segregation specifically dealt with Linda Brown, a young African-American girl who had been denied entry to a local elementary school in Topeka, Kansas because of the color of her skin. Celebrations this week. May 17th, World Baking Day. May 18th, Visit Your Relatives Day. May 20th, um, Be a Millionaire Day. May 21st, Pizza Party Day. May 22nd, Sherlock Holmes Day. May 23rd, Turtle Day. May 24th, Brothers Day. May 26th, Blueberry Cheesecake Day. May 27th, Hamburger Day. And May 31st, Web, Web Designer Day. Buddies are great. This week we are focusing on the letter V for valuable. One way you can be valuable is to encourage others. And here's Dr. Sabatini with the principal's update. Good morning, Barrow Buddies. It is exciting to see you. We have our last week of school. It's our last BTV um, this week. And so I want to begin by thanking our awesome BTV crews that we've had this year who've had to figure out how to do BTV in a new way. And they've done a great job. So thank you to all of our fifth graders and to Mr. Plemons who helped the BTV this year. Mr. Weaver helped in the beginning. So awesome. Thank you so much. Um, this week, we have a few things going on celebrating our fifth graders. Um, we are excited to spend more time celebrating all their achievements this year and to think back on their times that they've had at Bear Elementary School before they transition to middle school. We'll be having our fifth grade moving on ceremonies after school hours on Monday and Tuesday, some other special events for fifth grade, a bell ringing. Um, and so we're so proud of all that they've accomplished during their time here at Barrow, and we wish them the very best in middle school. Other grade levels will be having some transition and celebratory events as well this week, which is great. Um, and I just want to thank all of you Barrow buddies for working so hard this year and really persisting through lots of different challenges. You've all had to manage virtual instruction, in-person instruction, mask wearing, dividers, lots of hand sanitizer, <laughs> hand sanitizer, um, being separated from some of your friends in different classes and you've made it through um, really well. And so you should be really proud of yourselves. So congratulations on getting through a really, really hard year. We look forward to summer and a new school year ahead. And we are excited about seeing Bear Buddies back at Bear School eventually. What I would like you to think about uh, is um, I am brave, buddies are brave. And so this summer, if you're missing us and you're wishing you're at school or thinking about your friends, I want you all to have your mantras ready. And I want you to say, I am brave. I am bold. I am responsible. I am an achiever. I am valuable and I am engaged. I'm a brave bear buddy. So just think of us and we'll be thinking of you. Um, and we hope that you have a really great week at Barrow this week. Let's check out birthdays for May. Happy birthday to Jay Cook, Tyler Little, Azaria Martin, Jesus Hildago Montoya, Eden Brown, Bailey Van Note, Martavius Robertson, and Chance Thomas. Also to Zamaya Bishop, Jamarian Jones, Mayana Cooper, Louis Ortega, Owen Moore, Caitlin Wiseman, Anderson Plemons, Jalen Moodle Moodle,
Mason McAlvin, Miles Scott, and Jack Whetstone. Roal Batari, Marwan Eldumani, and Maddie Cohen. Happy birthday, buddies. Also to our staff members, Miss Hegel has a birthday in May. Happy birthday to Miss Wyatt, Miss William, Miss Renee in the cafeteria, Miss Monroe, and Miss Kiza. Lots of shout outs this week. Ms. Freeman wants to give a shout out to our newest Barrow buddy, Andrea. She is new to Georgia and to Barrow and is such a brave star. She takes risks every day and is a role model for being bold. We are so glad you are here. Also shout out to Jaden for being a state winner in the Give Wildlife a Chance poster contest. Way to be bold and put your talents out there. I'm so proud of both of you. Mrs. Kaplan would like to give a shout out to room 18. We are readers in room 18. I'm so proud of the hard work you've all put into your learning this year and for being such brave buddies throughout the entire school year. All of the fifth grade teachers would like to give a shout out to the fifth grade students for their hard work, flexibility and positive attitudes this school year. We know that this was not what you all were imagining for your last year at Barrow, but we are so proud of you and know that you are going to do great in middle school. Continue to show your leadership this last week and finish strong. Ms. Virtus would like to give a shout out to all the students in her virtual class who did their best by trying their best. I appreciate each and every one of you and your families. Ms. Kim would like to give a shout out to our amazing fourth grade students. You have all grown so much and kept positive attitudes even in this very unusual year. I'm so proud of all of you, all that you've achieved. Great job, buddies. Ms. Leggett and Ms. Haygood would like to give a shout out to their entire third grade class. You all have worked so hard and have made this year so much fun for all of us. We love you and we are so proud of you. Hope you all have a great week at Barra School. Here's a joke for you. Why did the chicken go to the seance? To get to the other side. Before we leave, let's say our bearer honor code together. As a bearer buddy, I promise to be fair, honest, and trustworthy, even when no one is looking, because that is the right thing to do. My good choices will help make bearer excellent. We will now observe a moment of silence before we begin to focus all of our attention on thinking, learning, and working at bearer school. Have a nice week and a wonderful summer break.